There are a pair of poodle puppies born without two of their legs. It's an ugly result of bad breeding, an issue the city says is all too common. News 13's Alex Goldsmith is in the Newsplex with that story. Dean, those two puppies were living on the streets before a good Samaritan stepped in. This is Diego and Frida. They were born without both front legs. Shelter vets believe they're the result of inbreeding. It's pretty uncommon, but you know, I don't think I'd say it's extremely rare. And we do commonly see animals missing a limb or having a heart condition. They can be minor issues, too. One shelter dog we saw today had a hairless chest and belly. Another, Kiara, has an adult body but puppy front legs. When pets have these kinds of defects, shelter workers have to determine whether it's more humane to keep them alive or put them down. Some of the problem comes from people breeding higher end designer animals or breeding so they can experience having a litter of puppies or kittens. The shelter says if you want to do that, you can help them foster animals instead. In fact, that's how Diego and Frida found a new home. Their foster parents were able to find a family willing to adopt those two legged poodles. Back to you. All right, Alex, thank you. And the shelter can always use help. Last year alone, the city took in more than 22,000 pets and had to put down almost 4,000 of them. If you're curious about the foster program, we've put a link on our website, krqe.com. Just click on links.